Hi, Mike Redding here from Using Technology Better. I've got a real short tip for you today for those of you that are using OneNote or for those of you that are thinking about using it. One of the greatest features I believe that we have inside OneNote is the ability to print pages straight inside our OneNote page. So while I'm here in my OneNote file, what I can do is I can go up to here in the insert and then say File Printout. Now when you do this, uh, you can go and check and find a PDF or a teaching resource, a Word document, and then you can print it straight in. Quite often what I see people doing is just inserting the file attachment, and then that just attaches the file into your OneNote, and you can double click on it to open it. But when you insert the file printout, you can see here that this Word document has printed directly into the OneNote file. Now if you have a large document like this one here, then you do need to go into your settings and say to insert the printout all on the one page rather than creating lots and lots of OneNote pages for each page. Uh, that trips some people up sometimes. But here's, here's the great thing. Now that I have my, uh, my Word document here, I've just pulled one out at random uh, into it, what I'm able to do is use my pen function on, uh, I've got a Surface Pro here, and what I can do is I can circle text, I can write on top of that. So if this was a Word document that you wanted your students to fill out, they could write their answers on. Uh, if they needed to label a diagram, for instance, they could label it straight on there. Now here's the great thing about this, then taking it the next step. In my Word document here, which is also open on my computer, so let me just uh, double click on this and it will open it for us in Word. What I'll be able to do now is I'll be able to update that Word document. So let's just say for instance I take this one here where it's got an S and I turn it into a Z. If I go back to my um, document here you'll see that you can't see any changes just yet but as soon as I click the Save button here in my Word document if I go back here it says here the printout may be out of date right click here to refresh details so I'm just going to click on refresh printout and you'll see here that it's going to pick it up from that and it's just going to reprint it for me so here it comes in here there's the Z come down here to my OneNote Let's go back up to the top and you can see that the proposals is still there but here's the great thing all of my annotations are still there for me so if you've got a document and you want to update it for your students it's a super easy way to do it just go insert and then file printout let the students annotate take their notes highlight text uh, and so on and then if there's any changes that you want to make you can just push those changes straight there so hopefully that's helped uh, i'll see you in the next video